The Earth and its movements. The Earth is the third planet from the Sun. And it has a unique characteristic that no other planet we know has. It's the only one that has life on it. Life of all types, plants, animals. Its average temperature is 15 degrees Celsius and because our planet also has water and an atmosphere, it is the perfect place for life. Like other planets of the solar system, the Earth moves in two different ways. One is called rotation and the other is called revolution. Rotation is the movement of the Earth on its own axis. Rotate means to turn, so the Earth turns around a slightly inclined imaginary line that joins the two poles called the axis. Do you know how long it takes to make a complete turn? It takes 24 hours to make one rotation. Think about it for a second. One day, day and night together, lasts 24 hours too. So the movement of rotation causes day and night. Interesting, right? Now let's see the movement of revolution. As you can see in the pictures, the Earth goes around the Sun in an elliptical orbit. That might sound a little strange, but if you look, you'll see it's simply the journey that the Earth makes around the Sun. Do you know how long it takes the Earth to make a complete revolution around the Sun? Well, it takes 365 days, exactly one year. This revolution movement is what makes the spring with its colorful flowers. The hot summer full of fun. The autumn when leaves fall from the trees to the ground. And the cold and frosty winter. So let's remember the two kinds of movement that the Earth makes. There is rotation, which is the Earth turning around itself, causing day and night, which lasts exactly 24 hours, the same as a whole day. And there is revolution, which is the Earth traveling around the Sun, which takes 365 days and causes the seasons. So now you know the movements of the Earth. Goodbye everyone and don't forget to subscribe to Happy Learning.